Okay. I'm not looking forward to breaking the news to him anyway. The Woodland apartment. Subs. Early morning. And we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real Toad. mess. Yeah. Uh, almost a morning looks to get worse here. than a day. Is somebody up there? Hey! Hey, wait here. Are you? Disappeared. Shit. Well, he's gone. That's for sure. I'm sorry. That's enough, all right. Just shut it. That's Todd. For this shit. But what do you remember? Holland doesn't make this much of a mess. Nothing else. I can search nothing. Let's just go downstairs. So Snow is arguing with Todd. Is What's up, Snow? That his son? Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? Why? I just enter. <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. What is happening, Todd? Sorry, Big B. It's embarrassing, we have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know. False alarm. Sorry for I dragging Miss White into this. Todd. There was someone, but they took off when we got here. Is that right? I guess your dad's ears have a year or two left. Haven't gone totally to the dogs, eh? Are you all right? He's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna? So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. I'll leave when I'm ready, Toad. I just want to check things out first. Toad, don't tell me how when The longer you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, Michelle. Surely all. you don't. Now, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. Phew. Grown-ups. Am I right? Uh... Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? Insect collection. Nice. It has a weevil. Cool. What is a weevil? Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. Well, there is a lamp that is smashed. Now this happened. Fucking hell! Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh huh. No shit. The lamp just fell off the table. Well, the boy was faffing about, playing salts and saltfish. Who knows with the lad? Yeah, sure. Why is he still plugging? Oops. 
Oh, the exam is the... That's a blood stain. That is blood. Bleeding? Why? You say it's blood. Still fresh. Oh, well, I'll cut me end. Ran around like sure. a trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds painful. Sounds Oi! Painful. Don't you go mother ending now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks have been a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. Why don't I believe you? Well, I don't think that you stabbed your hand with that. I surely don't think that. There's more blood over here. On the poker? Yeah. What happened? Oh, well, that's... that's how it happened, didn't it? Yeah. Well, I was... I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like Not a seashell. Foot. Looked like a shit ugly thing. If you're gonna say something, I out with it. Happen. Wait, you dropped it on your foot? You told me before that you cut your hand. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop sure. the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> uh, ruinous flip of events, really. Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? Because you're a fucking frog. I mean, things happen, you know. I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. Of course you are. Yeah. To tell you the truth, I don't know yet. I know you're lying about something. But I'm not- but You're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm you not bullshitting you. you. Honest. We'll see. Blood, you know what happened, I... No, there's marks here on the windowsill. And what's that about? No what real reason. Just last night, when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. <laughs> and I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had oh. to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Really? Scared Junior off to death. What do you mean? There's a clean space in the dust over here. Oh, uh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? Hmm. The lamp was there. Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? What's the point of all this, mate? Really? That broken lamp used to be here. Be right? here. Tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And, how did and why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because it wasn't on that table, Toad. There isn't any room in the electric outlets. Huh? What are you... It was plugged in over here, and now it's there. I, I did some refiguring. Yeah, sure. Who fucking cares? And not plug it in? Come on, Toad. I just hadn't gotten around to it yet. You see how many damn plugs there are? Stop lying, Todd. You're just making it worse. Let's stop the snow. Though most people think they are. Uh-huh. How's it going? 
Toad's hiding something, but I don't know what yet. Did the kid say anything? No, nothing really. He was really upset, though, earlier. He won't say why. Something's going on. Of course, stay with the kid until I figure out why. And why is the lock busted? Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. A spot of dust and a broken lock. What are you getting at, mate? Oh, for Christ's sake, a fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just look everything else in this bloody building. Sure. Why'd you climb in through the window, then? Huh? Why'd you climb in through the window? You said it yourself. The lock's been rotten for weeks. You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. Fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head. That's all it was. I forgot a fucking handle was fucking busted. And I'll tell you what else. It's embarrassing you bringing all this shit up, all right? So quit it with a third degree and all that. Big B, come on, I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking one. forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken enough of a day with all this... the sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I call, really I am. But will you please, please just bugger off? No. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet? You say, to my face, that you think I'm hiding something yes. from you? Well, you've had to go out of the room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. When, you tell me the truth. when you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? The truth. I cut me end. I broke the lamp. I scared him. This is all getting a bit stressful, alright? I have my limit Grab for him. bullshit, Toad. And I think we reached it ten minutes ago. Now, Dad! you're gonna tell me what's going on here, or I'm gonna start! Dad! <laughs> the big bad wolf. Higby, is this really necessary? Oh. What is it? Is it hurt? This is yes. the job, Snow. You may not like it, but this is the job. Dad! Oh my god. Take off your hat. Higby, you didn't... He didn't. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Dame D. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. Butcher. He come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place. Beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. <sighs> it's been a whole morning, I can tell you that. What was he looking for? I don't have a fucking clue, Sheriff. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. You wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, sometimes? Borrows? I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We're well, merely repossessed what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Well, the next Touching of the kin fur. is probably dead, so dead. Fine bit of dress it is. So I don't think she has anyone left. Nice place for a coat, bro. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. And that's the Donkey Kong. With a note. Wait. Looks like a note. It's an envelope. Envelope. Hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? I'll open it. Fuck it. I'm 
I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. But maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. I'll be honest, Bigby. I don't really know how to feel about what happened in there. We got what we came for. Some information. So, the prince is now? Lawrence is, yeah. It's our best lead. Best our team. only lead, really. When you put it that way. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look Maybe around for it. He's dead. And if he objects? We're here on official Fabletown business. And we can be persuasive if necessary. Or you can. I'll beat his ass if he's not dead. Let's go in. Just open it. Well, he's dead. Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with No! Him. No! He's still alive. What the? Oh. She... What is it that you're telling us? Oh. Oh. Bigby, water. Kitchen. I don't know what to bring his fucking water. Let him bring his own water. What am I? Where is this kitchen? Where is... Oh. You sing. We need a glass, big screen. Okay, glass, glass. Fine. What is that? What does that say? Pay the rent next week, pizza in the fridge. Did you find it yet? Yes, I found the water. But so hard to find about water. If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Hmm. Who did this Who to you? Who did this to you? the girl did this to him. This is very confusing. Do you still have that letter? Yes. It's only 
two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. We need to figure out what happened here, and find whoever did this. Well, thank you guys for watching, see you next time.